Okay. Is that the only electronic around here? Oh, wait, here we go, receiver. I wonder if I can get a farm at some point. I don't think I like, obviously, we're not getting like a real farm, but maybe I could grow some of the weird anomaly eggs at the base. That would be sweet. That's probably not likely to happen. We have a fish tank that we could get in the future. Alright. I'm going for like one more set of tree candy or so, uh, well, look, some caps. What did Alan tell you about his work? He was second in command of Dr. K's lab after all. Alan didn't discuss his work with me. Nor did I share mine with him. Wait, you are head of the whole stinking department. You must have known something about what that lab was doing. And if there was anything useful to be found, I'd have sussed it out already. That's all I did after the accident. Trying and failed to find any answers. Is that what this crystallized sap is? The tree candy, but in a different form? I can read my entries on those. It's just kind of... my logs are ending up like... my emails. <laughs> I'm just accumulating thousands of them. Let's see... Neon Reef! <clears throat> At first I thought I was seeing things after, well, you know... After that incident when so many of us saw things, and then they promptly told us to never talk about it. I figured this was just another hallucination. Something else I shouldn't log or report. Like how we don't talk about the things that chase us. Or the flies at Red Meadow, or the weird weather, or... I know I'm getting off topic. Point is, whatever this stuff is, it both responds to... Why is it doing this? No. This is even worse. <laughs> Twisted Ember. Typically, carbon only exhibits liquid properties at high liquid or high temperatures and pressures, generally over 4,500 degrees Kelvin and 1,100 atmospheres. A week ago, if you'd asked me about the conditions in which I expected it to exist, I would have presented these figures. But after a, what seems to be a combination of mass hallucinations, seismic events, and radiation bursts, more and more of the zone is behaving differently. The environment. The weather, even substances and elements themselves seem altered, as if mutated. In the woods west of our facility, what appears to be some form of liquid carbon flows like sap through many of the torched or petrified trees. Certainly, it is hot, but not so that it can't be collected and handled. Initial analysis now sh uh, show that it still behaves and reacts like carbon, but in this new form it is lighter, less dense, and yet also burns more efficiently. Flask, we have collected several liters here. for further study. And Neat. We'll find it at his lab. I'll take that on. I want your flask. Just to put gasoline in and fuel my car. Hmm. Oh, are they like right next to each other? Holy shit! That's cool. Okay. I see some more compressed sap. I need it. It makes a lot of sense now why the third or like the next level of the impact hammer uses sap. 
to create it. <laughs> it all just combines together. Uh-oh. Something shooting acid at me. All right. Fuel, tiny bit, tiny, tiny bit. Every bit counts. My car is a super gas guzzler. Oh my god, it got so much quieter suddenly. That one's big, holy shit! I gotta go... ...before I'm covered in acid! Maybe I've been here a little too long. The storm stopped, but the fog's gotten thicker. It is ominous. to make such a big mess too I'm, fucking, I'm going back to base with like 400 plus tree candy I don't remember what I need it for but I know at least three things needed it Now that's good enough for me to become a hoarder about it. Okay, there's a lot of compressed sap over here. God damn. At this rate, I might just be all armored panels from here on out. Only the highest quality gear for my car. <laughs> Sap compressor. You don't look like the sap compressor. Uh 
What the fuck is up here? Oh, there's like a legit box up there. <laughs> okay. Car! We got so many upgrade materials. I need, I need to account. Uh... Looks like we have 40? No. I think we have like... A hundred thermosap crystals, holy shit. So is this the facility that we were supposed to look for? Certainly looks like a big old entrance. Uh-huh. I found out one of my quirks. I think when my car wheel goes to the right, my uh, headlights slow down. I need an elect electrician's kit. Okay. I've learned. I know my way around now. Plastic into chemicals. That I might be able to manage. I gotta check how much plastic I have downstairs. Ugh. I can't have my flashlight out because this stupid anomaly encounters three. Okay. Put it in here. Okay, so plastics are like this. We've got... We got like 40 plastic, so I'll, I'll like maybe 20 more than that, so 60 plastic. I feel like that's a fairly accessible resource, so let's see what happens when I convert it. Okay. Sixty plastic. No way. <sighs> All right. That was sad. Sixty plastic turned into six chemicals. That's a conversion rate of ten to one. Unhappy. I wasn't expecting one-to-one. -one. I was kind of oh, excited for the idea of it. But like, five-to-one would have been nice. I'm just desperate for plastic, man. These trans these transmuters are so lame. For how little you find them sometimes, you know? All right, let's get a move on. Dr. 
Dr. K's access records were coded to the lab that used to be here. I'm feeling less optimistic by the second. Not a scour this place clean. Uh, something's here. We just can't see it. Oh, following a hunch. <laughs> Not your usual M.O., Oppie. No, but being suspicious of Arda is. All right. Oh, wow. <laughs> hey. It got marked above us. We got to find a way up. I'm thinking it's probably this way. I'm trying to figure out my quirk too. But maybe not the best place for me to figure it out. Where are you going? This should have been the end of the facility. According to the blueprints, anyway. I was just driving along. There's a big ass hole in the wall. Whoa! Got that. Well, well. After all these years, and honor still has something to hide. <laughs> We're definitely onto something now. Driver, anything you find down there, scan and transmit it back to us. We'll work on disengaging the security protocol. Okay. How's this? Experiment data. Art of Phenomena Report. 0623. Okay, here's something. This thing in the deep zone, they called it the well. Oh, fantastic. Tobias, run those reports through the decryptor and see what you can find. Search research platforms for scannable lab data. I wonder if I should bring, like, engine parts with me in the future. Because, you know, there's the one that runs on electricity rather than gas, and, uh, that could be useful. This Tobias, your remnant origin story, if you will. So let me guess, you're about to ruin a good urban legend with a bunch of science. <laughs> Fine, I'll read this one myself. Nice work, driver. We'll review these and summarize our findings after. What if I want to read it now? Obviously, I can just do that. It's just a little out of the way. Yeah, nothing in the non-lit up areas. So many spark towers, holy shit. I'm gonna go for him. I should be getting all this plasma. Maybe if we're lucky, some of these reports are audio reports. Huh? No. Fuck. Lab report. No. Nope. 
I don't know where precisely the ones I just got got put. Uh, nothing new in there. Yeah, Alright. Yeah, I guess they'll just read it back to me later. Shit, you had more? <laughs> Whoops, my bad. No, my hammer. My red headlights fucked. Worn out, yeah. Uh, okay, gotta make another one. Impact hammer. Get that close. These things are hostile. But I've learned how to manage them at the very least. They just kind of go towards where they originally were aiming at you. At first, it felt like they were just following me in general. out of fuel here. I just don't want to turn on my car and turn it off again every time I get out. Unless I'm like really getting out for a while. These lab notes are complete gibberish. What about these diagrams though? It looks like he was trying to convey something. You can admire the doctor's newfound art skills all you want. You won't find anything useful in them. Ooh, okay, that one's a little bit further out. I think the way out is maybe going to be over here. I'm gonna get all the research first. Wait. Turning off the car. This is a decrypted record of the accident. Poppy, are you sure you want to hear this? It's got details about Helen's final moments. It's been over 30 years. I'm past ready. Go on, driver. Keep snooping and see what else you can find. That's my goal. <laughs> and I'm making sure to knock out 
plasma generator, so I know where I have and haven't been. Damn it. Oh, thanks! <laughs> you trying to say something? You saying my car is banged up? It's in pretty good condition. Mostly because I actually have been fixing it up a little bit more on this run than I normally do. I used the blow torches. Two of them. Back at where we started. Which means now I have to cross over. Ooh. I wonder if they go up into that. Maybe not yet. to the stabilized access room. So I'm not going up to that, yeah. <laughs> door, which I think is going to be over here, maybe? No? Uh. Oh, I see it. It has a red pulsing light over it. Extra no to get the hell out of Dodge. It's okay, we can take a little, little bit of damage here. I'll take a look over here. But I'm not seeing tree candy or anything. Or do we pass by? Lab? Sure. Is nice. My inventory is full. Shit. And there's a left right anomaly right on the door. Fuck. I was gonna drive my car up for convenience sake.
Well, I should be able to grab at least a little bit more. Is this just a highway out of here? No gateway needed? That doesn't feel right. <laughs> yeah, shit. Back roads. They're setting me on a far on journey. <laughs> I don't know where the hell we're going. energy. Lame. Document one. Data. Well, I'm getting out. Olympium fragment. Ah, oh, shit. I fucked up. Okay, this summer tire. Fuck up. I at least want this. I need the electronics. Want for all this? Okay. Now we can get the fuck out of here. My first Olympium fragment, one of many. Oh, ye, ouch. Oh, what a hell of a spot, what the fuck? There's a crash pod right on top of the escape portal. Pod gave me a good bit of stuff, so I'll, I'll go for it. But my inventory's mess. I will. There it is. What's in here? Steel door, steel door, steel panel, steel panel. Some repair putty, I'll take it. Alright, I'm good. Ah, fuck, okay. I goofed.
Okay, we're just gonna carry this on hand and leave. Except for the issue of the old wall. Right, yeah. That. Uh, you got some genius idea up your sleeve, huh? Is that how you think it works? That scientists conjure up genius at will? Well, yeah. Do you? Oh, well, in this case, I do. <laughs> but don't expect it to work like that every time. Driver, the quarantine checkpoints will be the best way through the old wall. But they're death traps in their own right. But I designed something to help. Check out the blueprints I sent over. Okay. Prepare for the crossing. Where are the blueprints? Pick up blueprint from Oppie's new team. Limb Shield. This rough diagram provides all the instructions you need to assemble a new invention. Please note that you may be the first and only person to test this device. Yay! Craft a the old anomalies shield. took up residence in the crossing points. It's not enough to have a shield. The shield itself needs to be shielded. The energy drain on that shield is massive. It won't last you more than five seconds. Yes, and? You'll need to recharge on the go, but the deep zone's grid is completely dark. You know, what if we could reroute our power into the deep zone? But we'd need to jumpstart the network somehow. That car is basically the world's most overpowered electromagnet on wheels. The driver induces a current, then you open the electrical floodgates. And they'd have to induce the current the entire way through the old wall while making the crossing and maintaining speed. I don't know what to tell you. If you don't believe the driver and that car's got what it takes by now, then go back to hunting ghosts. We've got a job to do here. This could work. Are you in, Francis? I, I, I don't know. Look, we have a real chance of losing everything at the old wall. I'd like to not fail this far along. How can we know this will work? We don't. That's how science works. We form a theory, and we test it, and we fail, and fail, and fail, and only sometimes do we succeed. Come on, Francis. Please? Fine. I'll do it. <laughs> All right. The team is assembled. Driver, get on with building that limb shield. We'll work on spinning up the power grid in the meantime. You've got it. Okay. Well, first off... I'm gonna spend some of my resources on... Getting some bigger lockers. Is this outside? Why would I want a locker outside? Are those the only two places I can do it? Yeah. Yeah, that's going to be weird. I want to see what a pneumatic locker is like, though. Okay. I guess we can just throw this out here. Yay! An outdoor locker! I, guess, I don't know, I guess I just throw shit I don't care about <laughs> into there. Like, it could just be resources. That'd be fine. That's really what I'm looking for. Alright, what do I need for the pneumatic lockers? That's the real meat. Okay, so it's gonna use unstable energy, so that's... We're gonna put that on hold. It's a couple other things I want first. Same thing with the parts locker. Okay. Here's what I'm gonna go for. I'm gonna grab Ion Shield. So that I can 
start making my way towards mobile workbench. Ah, it needs 20 Olympium fragments. Scan a remnant ghost? What the fuck's a remnant ghost? We've got Nitro Boost. Or I can get Resource Radar. Let's get Resource Radar. That has my interest. Okay. And then we'll grab the other roof rack. Where we can now install our roof things. Alright, so, extra large roof storage. I'll put that in the back. Hell yeah. And then the resource radar. We'll see how that functions. Oh yeah. The Olympium fragment stuff still eludes me, but we got a lot of tree candy out of that run. Holy hell. Anything I can upgrade myself with with tree candy? I can make carbon fiber glass now with that, so I should be able to get a couple of things. Acid raincoat. Oh my god, all this stuff taking chemicals as well. Alright. Let's get some big upgrades. Eleven, twelve. I'm out of fabric. Holy shit. Unstable energy screws me over in so many places. I guess I'll grab this recipe just so I can see what lies beyond. So I need unstable energy for an expanded back seat tank. Oh, and I need stable energy for the plasma charge. The plasma charge is the lifesaver. How do I? What do I need for the Kalim shield? Sure, the battery cost for this protective device is significant, but in retrospect, it was so obvious that the projection and then suspension of semi-magnetized plasma ions in a rapidly oscillating spin or field would produce provide a substantial physical safeguard. Like, duh. Sure. Let's 
Installed upgrade. What is Does it go here? It looks like a... Looks like a bumper thing. It is a bumper thing. Okay. I hope that's better than this limb pulse emitter. Because I was liking that and I just barely got it. in my regenerator. Uh, we've got a lot of steel doors. Fantastic. Okay. Doors can go in this pile. took a door off <laughs> at the end of that last mission thinking I had a door to put on but it was I think just two panels I think there was a door inside the paw but it's not what I grabbed Things layout sucks. <laughs> These are not the things I want to. Like, there's a whole side here of stuff that I just can't fix up. It's fine. I should be able to at least get some steel panels into there. Broken, broken. This is not in great condition. This is kind of still fragile. I'll replace that.
I want better. I want to upgrade my headlights. Uh, Alright. So we're gonna make regular headlights. So we stop having a flickering light. And then I need, I think I need two steel panels. Uh, no, I need a steel door. There we go. Equip or install something in every possible slot on the car. Woo! <laughs> you mean I don't get any more cases? Uh, look, you could... You could double stack up. Get some side panels here, maybe. All right. Well, my tires are actually in pretty good condition, so I don't really need to do too much about that. I can't fix my pristine stuff, annoyingly, but I'll give it credit. It is lasting a good while. I don't think it's lasting more than this one or two more trips, though. Alright. Let's... Move some things around. this stuff away real quick. This back locker. Really, I think what I should put in here is all this, like, these bigger items, the dumpster pearls. That way, all the small stuff can still kind of be in one area. bottom. Maybe I throw them into the shredder. That just came across my head. Okay, all right, hold on. <laughs> We're looking this up real quick. Kablamo. That was dramatic sounding. Okay, all right. I... It took me way too long to figure this out. It's awkward that I thought about it right as I finally caved to like search it up and it just ended up confirming what I just thought now. But yeah, the reason these things have 5,000 health is because you're just supposed to fucking toss them into, uh, here. Holy shit. That has a lot of fabric and stuff, too. I'm impressed that this stuff hasn't, uh... gotten jammed up just yet. 
Me. All right. I'm not picking all that up, my really. So, auto bag. part put things away again the world's a different place now <laughs> well, the game's trying to tell me something like, hey, here's all these steel sheets. <laughs> Just make new parts, asshole. these big things, the steel sheets, bulbs are getting thrown in the back. Lovely. else can get thrown in here. Oh shit, right. <laughs> This is where the mouse comes in. I want these down here. And then everything else can go up top. Ish. Nice. Much better. Although there are also things in here that weren't. Like that. A lot of paint and stuff. This can get put away too for now. away the future stylings in these uncertain times we must look ahead to the future what is that about <laughs> i don't know why that didn't go away My car's a monster. <laughs> I 
the future stylings. Yeehaw, look at that. Uh, well, I've given it a giant glowing red eye. I hope my car appreciates it. I do like copper wires. All right, what's going on with the fax machine? I've been transformed into telephone signal. Please transform me back. I'm sorry, it can't happen, but thank you for storing my info. Store items for your drive in the car trunk. Limb shield. Oh. Is that what they want for me? To put it in here instead? Uh. Sulfur and smoke glows through the snow. It smells like money. <laughs> nice work on that limb shield driver. We'll have the power grid prepped by the time you reach the old wall. They don't want me to have it on now. You might have to hang behind. Uh, boy. Hang behind. It's okay. Now we have a fresh limb shield or limb pulse emitter. Woo! Let's get things assigned here. Okay, so we'll keep uh, the limb pulse emitter on square. Nope, that's not it. There we go, and then resource radar. Scan the area around the vehicle for materials. This savvy device may seem cheap and crude, but it's basically calibrated to detect nearby resources and raw materials. I hope it gives me really good info, because I don't know how this is going to work. My scrapper, a flashlight, I need my impact hammer. And I also need to make the new versions of them. If I have the resources, god damn. Oh, the magnetic hammer needs the limb magnet. Shit, I don't know. I don't got that. But I got. A lot of thermal sap crystals. in dire shambles at the moment. Alright, well we got a lot of repair putty, so that's nice. 
I could use a ceiling kit or two. If I have the resources. Yeah, we're running low on rubber. Holy shit. Grab a couple of electrician's kits for random locking or lock picking. That's all we're going to do. I kind of thought we had more resources for like, say, getting a ton of like plasma scrappers and thermal vacuums and the impact hammer upgrade too, but no. We're actually real desperate on that front. Dumpster burn. Let's go see what that's about. Ooh, high tech steering wheel. Ooh. That's our first time actually getting like a different option for one of these slots. My bad, I left the headlights on in my car. Yep, that sure is a ridiculous amount of buttons. Love it. Ah, but it doesn't change the horn. It makes sense. What do I need for the plasma scrapper? Yeah, rubber. I mean, I, I should make one anyways. Let me go out here. Don't know. The train is pulling out the station. Okay, so mark these. I just want to see what happens if we use all my charges. Not nothing, really. 
turncoat. That doesn't. I don't like that. Salamander Grotto. So there's some eggs on this route. Evaporation? No way! Underground mischief? There's so many crazy new things out there! Okay, so... I think I'll go here. I'm gonna give it one more chance. One more goddamn chance to let me, like, go to a location and let me go somewhere else. Please let me do that. Quirk fixed real quick. One of them at least. Alright, so. When my steering wheel goes right, my wipers move slow. Bad guess. Okay. Swerves hard. Really? It's not the wipers? Oh, shit. Oh, I finally found the place. Okay, at the bottom left it says hold square to investigate for 0 0.5 Klim. All right, I'll do that. Five hints found? What do you mean five hints found? Is my steering wheel like super cursed? Dashboard flickers? Okay. The dome light switches on. Damn it. No! And I got rid of my hint! No! Okay, no, the, the hints are still there. Thank fuck. How many guesses do I have left? Oh my god! Fine, whatever. I just won't fix the problem. 